We are here with the, the <laughs> very <Lord> noisy. <laughs> <laughs> very no Lord. Um, can you tell us a bit about what you do um, for the people that don't know about Lori Park, what it what it's about? Absolutely. It's lovely to have you. Thank you so much for the opportunity. This over here is Rex. Hello, Rex. And Rex is a Moroccan cockatoo. And at Lori Park Zoo, you can certainly meet him up close and personal. You can have fun with the owls too. There's lots of things you can do at Lori Park Zoo. It's great for children. It's great for adults. It's a small zoo. It's in the yeah. Durand. And uh, it really is a delight. We've got ring-tailed lemurs. There's a lovely tea garden. We do birthday parties. We have all sorts of animal encounters. It's a very personal experience with the animals and with the zookeepers. So the opportunity to visit Lori Park Zoo is definitely up your alley. Yeah, it's definitely a must. My head, well, Ross and I have been there ourselves and we'll definitely go back because it's such a lovely place. It's so different. And the fact that you take care of animals that have been hurt and yes. things like that as well. It's different because they need they need love and, and, and caring as well. So they certainly do. They certainly um, do. And um, so what made you decide to come to Icon? <laughs> What made us decide to come to ICON? I think it's just such an opportunity to share what we do with the community that, oh, we've got some warmth, my darling. I How many people are at the Lori Park Zoo all together? Oh, we've got a lovely staff compliment. We have a lot of interns, a lot of volunteers, believe it or not, which is really, really great. Yeah. But generally, we've got approximately 40 staff members, which is a really nice number because animals need personal attention. Yeah. They need to have personal attention, yeah. especially like with this little Rex <laughs> character. Our macaws and our cockatoos definitely need the love. Mm. So yes. Okay. Um, your stress levels when it comes to doing exhibits or events and that sort of thing, do they go really high, really low, do they stay the same? It really depends on the animals that we have and the audience that also come to the shows. So we choose the animals that work for the environment and it's welfare above all else. So if an animal is uncomfortable, we will certainly change the habitat or return it to the zoo, depending. Okay. And then because we are at Icon, I have to ask the short sure. questions. Who is your favorite superhero, anti-villain, supervillain? Oh, Any what of fun. Oh, I love that. Well, I'm into wow. MTG, Magic the Gathering. Oh, yeah. So I do love the green deck. So with regard to superheroes and things, I don't know, I like Catwoman. Catwoman if, if, there was a, if there was a cockatoo superhero, <laughs> I would be a cockatoo. Unfortunately, there's not. Well, you can always make one. You can become bird lady or... There we go. You're going to help me, Rex. You're, you're a helpful sidekick. I think so. There we go. Yeah, sidekick. I like your that. Your favorite TV series? My favorite TV series? Oh, my goodness me. That's a difficult one. We're currently busy watching Valerian. Are you kidding? It's an old, it's a French one, but Valerian is currently okay. the one we're watching. And favorite movie that's come out? The favorite movie that's come out? Oh my gracious me, that's also a difficult one. <laughs> I don't know. All right. Uh, and Icon has obviously just started, but what is, has been your favorite part so far? Just people being so interested in the animals. I, I think that's so nice because many of the, the, the icon d delegates are gamers yeah. and their heads are in the cloud. So to see them touch and engage with animals, I think that's been my favorite. Thank you so much. Absolute pleasure. Thank you for the opportunity. And please come visit Lori Park Zoo. No, we definitely will. All right.